Hello everyone, and welcome to the Sliderama tutorial for the S6 control panel. In this video, we'll talk about how to create an SD card playlist using S6. Please consult the Lighterama website for more information about the type of SD card needed for playback with Showtime directors. Before beginning this process, all of the sequences you plan to use must be saved to your computer with the correct audio attached. The audio files you use must be MP3s in order to use an MP3 director. Insert the SD card into your computer, then click Next once you've selected the drive with your SD card. The next screen will ask you if you're creating a brand new show, or if you want to edit a playlist that's already on a card, like one of the preloaded Lightarama SD card options. As an advanced choice, you can have up to 9 different shows on one SD card, as long as the days and times don't conflict. A basic schedule or first year display will likely only have one show per SD card. On the next page, you'll select if you're using a mini director with no built-in clock, meaning you'll need to use an external timer to start your show, or one of the silver N2 or N4 directors, which have a clock built in. We'll use the second option in this tutorial. Next, you'll answer some questions about your director. A mini director has one port, an N2 has two ports, and an N4 has four ports. The generation of your director is printed on the front of the device. After answering the questions about the director, you can then add your sequences. You can add the files one at a time, or use Control on your keyboard to select multiple at once. After the sequences are added, you can click on any one to replace, remove, or change its order in the lineup. You can see the duration of your playlist in the lower right. Once you're happy with the order of your sequences, click Next to determine when your show will play. We'll set a schedule in this example. If you want an SD card schedule to be different on different days of the week, that's when you'll need to use more of those 9 show options at the beginning of this video. Here we're just going to set a simple schedule for all the days of the week from 5.30 to 10 p.m. Then click Update Selected Days so that the button outline turns white and shows that the schedule is in effect. This window is a part of selecting the daily schedule page and doesn't close when you save, so just click Next after choosing your days and times. Most of the time, you'll have your playlist loop continually for the duration of your start and end times, but here you can choose a more customized schedule if needed, including running filler or startup sequences. On this second to last dialog page, you'll set your networks and speeds by double-clicking on each line one at a time. Make sure that these settings match the sequences in your playlist, and that you're using at least 500k speed and enhanced if there's motion effects on the network. Visit the Lighterama website for more information about what controllers can be connected to networks at which speeds. Unless you have specific reasons to change these final options, leave the settings at their default, then write your show to your card. Make sure to safely eject after completion, and then your card is ready for use with your director. And that's all for this tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe so that you never miss a notification about new videos.